Hello everybody, my name is Hassan Ahmed. I am six years old and watching the trilogy presented. And today we are making Scratch. And in Scratch today our project is, what can it be? It is the jumping game. Now let's go to Scratch. And now let me tell you what is Scratch first. Let me share my screen. I have a Dell. If you have Apple, no worries. I'm going to tell you how you can open an Apple, but I have a Dell. I will go here, and the Scratch logo is an S. Let's click on the S. And now it's loading. Loading. Now this is Scratch. In Apple, it will load a lot, but still. Now oh, I'm gonna put my hair here. Well, today we're gonna make a jumping game. And before we make it, when you start the scratch, it will be like this. There will be a cat in here and there'll be some no blocks. We have to first delete this cat, but you can take the cat if you want, but I want to delete it because it will be very big for the, our jumping game. I'm going to click this delete. It's deleted. Now, first we need a backdrop. Now here is a choose to backdrop. Okay, this you could choose a backdrop. This you could paint the backdrop. It's a surprise and you can upload the backdrop. I'm going to surprise and this is mine. Now here, you can also surprise Sprite, but I will not take. I will take the chick. Now, what do we have to make the chick do? We have to make it jump. But I think you're not seeing its legs. Let's take another backdrop, I think. Blue sky. Now you can see. Now we have to make a jump. It's very easy, but we have to do some coding. It's not like we're just gonna click and it'll go up. First, we have to go in events, the yellow. And now we have to click when spacebar key clicked or pressed. When spacebar key pressed, then what will happen? It's this, this spacebar key on your computer. It can be anything like a tube sound, I think. Yeah, that's how our spacebar works. We are gonna take in the controls a repeat block. Here I'm gonna right click on it and duplicate it now i'm going to place it here and i'm going to make this go minus 10. minus 10. wait a minute in a minute maybe not make it on that minus 10. let's do it again i'm going to take another one Minus. Why is it not doing a minus? Okay, it's not doing a minus 10, but let me tell you what will happen. Let's delete first this. We are gonna go in here and we'll take change x or change y. What is x and y? Let me annotate for this. Annotate. X is left to right. And Y, it is up to down. This is X and Y. Since we are making, wait a minute, since we are making a jumping game, we have to make a jump. So we need a Y, change by Y, then, and we're gonna duplicate this all, and do this, minus 10. Not minus, minus 10. Now let's see what will happen. That's good, right? But the thing is now, it's not interesting. It's not a jumping game. It doesn't have any sound. So let's first put the chip sound, right? Chip sound right here. And now let's see. That's good. Now we go in the two sprites again. And now what will we take? A crystallite. So here is the crystal, and here in costumes, there are a big 
costume, it will not go and it will hit the uh, chick. So we have to delete this, and this is gonna be good here. I will go with code here. Now we have to code it. First, we have to make it go here, and this is very easy. You can do it. It will go here. How will you do it? Let's see. One green flag clicked. What will happen? We have to make it glide, right? We will need a X Y block here, and we are gonna glide it till here. Now let's gonna put this. We are gonna put this. We are gonna put a far hour block, and now let's see what will happen. Now it's working well, right? But now it doesn't have a gram or screen. It doesn't have nothing. Now we have to do a lot of innovations in this. We need now a gram or screen when it will touch. Here I know the perfect for it. We'll go in backdrop. Here stage where the backdrop three is seen. In backdrops, this one, this, we're gonna actually delete this. And here we're gonna delete this also. We are going to duplicate this, and now we have to actually delete all of this. Like, I'm going to click on this, delete, click on this, delete, 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 and one by one, we can delete all of them here and that and that. Now, that's how you delete. Now, we have to make a GAN over screen. We will go in the squares here and we will take whatever color you want. I put this to brightness and I will take the red one. Now we're gonna take here and we're gonna draw a big line. And the outline should be also red. That's good. But now there's a simple red screen. We don't need this, we need a text in it. And that's the perfect way to use this T over here. When you lay it, it says text. We're gonna do this. And you see this up here? We can go in here and we can do anything. Drummel or marker or curly or pixel. And I don't know these languages, but I think they're Chinese. I'm gonna take the pixel. I'm gonna put it here. And I'm going to do game over. M E. Now we made it, but the thing is, why did not see? We have forgotten its color. We'll make it like light orange. There you go. Nothing, but the thing is, it's not big. We are gonna make it big by clicking on this, and now do that and make it big. Like that, we're gonna do this, put it in the center. There you go. Now we have a perfect camo screen, but it will be always there. So we don't make it always there when it will touch. So I'm going to do this and I'm going to go blue sky. We go in code again, but when it will touch, it will not go. So what we have to do, we have to go in here and we have to do one touch. But how can you do it? First, we need a green flag block. And when is a short, short abbreviation for if then? I just always mispronounce abbreviation. If then. Or when put it here, and what will happen? Let me tell you what a if then. If then is if the ball is hitting me, then game over screen. That's a if then. So we are doing the same thing here. We are gonna take the if then here, but. We didn't put anything. 
we should do one in sensing the first block touch mouse pointer touch mouse pointer and what is a mouse pointer it will touch the mouse pointer we don't need that to do one touch check when it will touch the check what would happen it will be go to here blue and blue sky too now let's see what we have the thing is it's not working why because you see here if then is not working it's only taking one time so we have to make it go for everything there you have it but the thing is that it's always going it will never stop so when you do this it will not happen why because we have not even do this we have to do one like space bar key click and then change it to blue sky not to it should be blue sky now let's see, go now let's see now we did it but now the thing is that it will not stop how will make it stop it will be not good that we do it in here we can do it in the chick right so we'll go here and we'll do one it but first we have to do the green flag but one if then when it will touch it should stop all like one it will touch touch sensing 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 mouse pointer sensing is crystal when it will touch crystal then what would happen the thing is it should stop all i have a perfect block for this it's in the controls down here stop all of the things now let's see i did this now the thing is why it's not stopping only not even the bird is stopping why because it's not activating it we have to do forever right but when it will do it will not stop all it will have to get again but first let's see if it will actually happen this end but now let's do this and it's again that's perfect but the thing is you might be saying where's the score yeah we will not miss the score wait a minute first level we'll not miss the score we need the score now that's the perfect block to do it is is the variable with the variable right here variables and then make a variable make a variable we will wait a minute make a variable with the score score now it's here the score is up here but when i jump it will not do it. so i know what we will do we will do change one we jump over it change my variable by one we will transform it in a chick and hit it but one when it will play and then now let's see the thing is the score is too slow it will not happen wait a minute when it will jump it should end immediately so what will we do here we will take this one space bar key click and now we'll put this down here now let's see another thing it's no problem that we are just doing this it will not happen the other thing for this is that first you have to make it go to zero so you can when touch it's easy but i'm not tell you one thing here what is my variable we are controlling the score 
What's the matter, everyone? We have to make this to score and this to score as well. Now let's see what will happen. Actually, the tick is too high. Let's put it down here. It stopped. But the thing is, you're saying that why is it not go over it? You thought it would go this, right? Now let's see what I'm going to tell you why not happening. Go. Now let's see. Do you see that? It's not stopping, right? Go. Now there you have it. That is your on jumping game. I hope you like this. I hope you enjoy this. And scratch on.